Good morning and welcome back to Carlton Farm. It's the last week of November now, so we are popping down here. We are going to park our landy in the gateway there because we have got this headland to do and this bit of field down the bottom. There's plenty of field left to plough. Want to get the ploughing finished today if we can. And then See that fetched all the paint off the fields. Not that many breeds left to do down here now to get this out to the end that gets that sorted out we will now yeah not that many breeds left in here to get the main body finished then we've got the <coughs> Edlands to do then the plough can be put away until next autumn when we will need it out again gone well this ploughing of this field. You can see how far we've come since the last time that you was with us. There we go. Maybe some headlands up that side. Looks like we've got a bit wider this end than we have at the top. This is tractor already over 27 hours so it's in the short space of time we've been on the farm one full season and then that part season where we bought the farm uh, we are coming into our second full year our third year on the farm And yeah, field in front of us all nicely ploughed. That will be staying in its ploughed state until the spring when we can get the cultivator in or the drill. We also need to get the stone picker in here. And it could be a case of buying a stone picker as we go forward. You 
just having a mouthful of coffee, but that was it shortly. Yeah, probably tomorrow we will make a start on selling the rest of our crops that we've got to sell. Still got potatoes, wheat, and oilseed rape to sell. As well as our potatoes, our straw, and we will hopefully have enough money to either buy more land or at least we can see if we can lease some land going forward I know there is a company in the area what leases farms that land out uh, we will have a word with them before too long. Keep going as long as we can. Got plenty of fuel on the tractor, although it does need a service again. It's halfway down its service bar. But that could be the plough, actually. Definitely going to be an headland up that side. I think by the time we get back to the top there, we will be into where we need to leave some headland. We will continue and finish the ploughing off screen if we don't get to the end of it by the time we leave you for today. Uh, just under halfway through today's episode so might get a little ways towards at least getting into the Edlands the downward breed away we go Still not made a mark. I think this field, this side, will be potatoes next year. 
the one across from the yard will either be sorghum or oats depending upon what we decide to grow as I say we are looking to get into sugar beet but there's enough farmers growing sugar beet at the moment Uh, unless we can find somebody selling land that's got sugar beet contract that they want to sell with that land we can't grow sugar beet on the farm here uh, let's just now get ourselves Here we go again. Engine sounds, I know I've said it before, but they are so much better in 22 than there was in any incarnation before it. Here the tractor as it's working with the revs dropping and rising. is across the end there is it a wood yard looks like it could be a wood yard there yeah, it has got logs outside <coughs> now about halfway through today's episode I'm still busy ploughing the weights by me easy so yeah we will hopefully get all this ploughed today well, I should get it ploughed today. It's only ten past nine in the morning. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah, it's only ten past nine in the morning, quarter past nine now. And we are getting to... where the rows start to shorten get ourselves turn our soles round but that will do nicely there away we go so this is the last of the field work for 2022 we will be back in the fields in 2023 but for now we've got to get this ploughing finished and get all our crops sold over the winter could be that we skip 
a few days over the winter to get you back to the spring again, but depends if we've got anything to show. In the next, probably tomorrow, we shall sell our straw. Get that off the farm. weeds down this end really have grown big aren't they into flower in November which is a strange one but they will disappear under the ground Getting some land there to let off for sale, so we could possibly lease that pot of land there. It should be a well, it's a massive area of land, but <coughs> would be good for growing. Cereals on. Bit of straw here that needs ploughing under. The plough will take it under, it works well with burying surplus residue straw like that. Get ourselves back in again. Burying the surplus straw once again that was left when we bailed. <coughs> bit of a brick wall down here separating what land we've got to the land that's for sale or to rent. To the expensive land as well. It is building land but there could possibly be visitor estates development land so yeah it could well be that they could let us lease it until someone comes to develop it and we could work around their development 
Now there's talk of a block of houses being put in as well somewhere so we can possibly lease those bits. There is a couple of areas for development. Uh, we will see as we go forward what happens on that. First getting towards the end of the main body of the field and the end of today's episode here on Carmson Farm. We are Summer Farm Estates. We plan on growing our farm. The guy we bought this farm off says he was on the run down to retirement but seems a little strange that he kept the animal farm and got sure to this one the arable side of it that is to say what way you go with that As we grow the farm, there will be a lot more winter crops growing. Won't be wanting to be having too much more land to plough. a lot more wheat, a lot more barley and a lot more oilseed rape growing as we go through. to wear. Won't be too many breeds left to go down here now. couple of breeds to back into. There we have it. One more breed brought around. And we can start on the, there we go, get that gone down there. That turned over. And 
the way we go down this long breed of headland down this side of the field. And as we do make a start on the headlands, that is all that we've got time for today. I hope you enjoyed the last day of ploughing. Please give us a like, give us a share, drop us a comment if you're new to the channel and you'd like to see more of the work we do here, please subscribe to the channel. If you give that bell a ring, it will tell you when our content is available. Until you join us again next time, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed your stay with us. Goodbye for now.